This presentation is copyright protected, which is detailed on the last slide. Welcome. This video is designed to show the theory of operation as well as the function of the hydraulic drop quill assembly. In addition, you'll be shown the location and adjustment procedure for the drop quill on your Fisher snowplow. Note, prior to beginning troubleshooting and or repair, please review your owner's and installation manual to follow important safety procedures. The drop quill assembly's function is to control the drop speed of the blade when the control is put into the lower function. This setting is adjustable and can be tailored to the needs of the operator. It is a simple procedure and can be done with a blade attached to the vehicle. Note, before we begin, make sure the vehicle is parked on a hard level surface, the blade is lowered completely to the ground, and the vehicle ignition is in the off position. First, using the mechanics guide as a reference, find the location of the quill assembly. It is located in a slightly different place depending on the type of hydraulic unit you have. The quill assembly controls the drop speed of the plow by partially blocking off the lower circuit inside the hydraulic manifold. With the quill backed out, the passageway is not blocked and the blade will drop quickly to the ground. If a slower drop speed is required, turning the quill in will partially block off the lower circuit and slow the blade down to the desired speed. This setting is infinitely adjustable and can be customized to the needs of the operator. Check the adjustment of the quill by raising and lowering the blade to see if the drop speed is at the required setting. Once finished, you are ready for plowing.